Now introducing Motive 3.2. With this update, a handful of exciting new features, bug fixes, and workflow improvements have been added to enhance your motion capture experience. Here's a quick look at the new additions in this release. Calibrations are now saved as new .mcal files, a human-readable XML file that can be modified to meet the specific needs of your volume's calibration. Effortlessly recalibrate your skeletons without modifying the bone lengths, making the scale of your 3D characters consistent across your project's timeline. Select the whole skeleton, open the skeleton's context menu, strike a T-pose, and update the constraints only. IMU Sensor Fused Rigid Bodies now have an improved status indicator. The updated visuals guide you through the pairing process step by step, indicating how many of the samples required for optical alignment have been collected until pairing is complete. Reflections in your capture volume can now be masked in edit mode, allowing you to modify the content cameras display after recording your data. Skeleton tracking has been optimized to perform better in cases where joints could extend past their limits. Shoulders and passive marker fingers now solve and animate more smoothly than before. Additional improvements include Builder Paint Additions, VRPN Streaming, and Increased Video Export Sizes. Be sure to download Motive 3.2 to receive these great additions and enhancements that'll keep you tracking better than ever. To see the full list of changes, visit the links in the description below, or go to the OptiTrack support documentation where you can find all that Motive has to offer. And as always, thank you for choosing OptiTrack. <laughs>